Hello, this is Color Wind Plays, and this time we're going to do something a little bit different. Normally, I play a game and just give you a general feel of it, but this time I'm actually going to try to complete it. So this is actually going to be a multi-parter. Uh, this is a Genesis game called Haunting, starring Polterguy, and uh, this is not a very well-known game. Uh, it was made by Electronic Arts. It's a strange game in which the point is to scare everyone in this family out of their house. Uh, you do that by jumping into various objects and kind of activating them to do something scary. Like uh, you might make it explode or turn into some sort of monster or a severed head or just have it uh, like drip out and melt or spit out blood or something something to make it terrifying um, while playing this game you play as Polterguy that's that green dude that you see right there you play as him and then you press the A button to uh, jump into objects that's how you, that's how you activate it and uh, while you're playing, the family members um, in that room, uh, they can't see you. And because of that, you can't be hurt by them. So what happens is while you're in the living world, um, you have this ectoplasm meter that's slowly uh, going down. Uh, you can get more ectoplasm by scaring that person out of the room or out of the house completely, which is the ultimate goal. And you collect that and that will refill your meter. When your meter is completely down, uh, you'll go to like the underworld, I guess. I'm not exactly sure what the name of it is, but that's more or less what it is. And you go there and collect some more ectoplasm and once it's all filled, and you're done, then you can leave that and go back to trying to scare them out of the room. See, those are the ectoplasm drops right there that you can get and collect. Um, while you're un in the underworld, you can get hurt, and if you die, then the game is over. You only get one life, but again, in the living world, you can't die at all, so, you know, fair trade, I guess. Uh, this first playthrough is going to be of the first level. And then uh, the next video will be the second, third one, the third, the fourth one, the fourth, and the end of the game. There are four levels, and here we go. So I'm going to open my map here, and uh, okay. There's someone in the other room. Here. I'm going to jump into some things. Scare. Figure out. There we go. Got her into the other room. Depending on what you jump into, some of them will be activated and to be used later, and then others will uh, just be activated right there and then. The orange ones are activated then, the blue ones are activated later. There is a strategy to how you should be using these, so keep that in mind. Like it's good to have a whole bunch of blue ones. And then right when they think they're going to leave the room, use an orange one. See, right now she's pretty calm, but now she's low. So she's kind of spooks like, what's going on in this place? <laughs> I'll freak her out. There's also that thumping. <laughs> That's supposed to represent her, her heartbeat. increasing <laughs> so I freak her out green ones are ones that you can activate so there's more for you to do uh, you'll be pressing the A button a lot in this game almost act out of ectoplasm I need this girl to run out of here Uh, 
I'm not gonna make it. I didn't make it. Okay, this is the underworld. And, uh... It can be hard to get through sometimes. Yeah, so you got those arms that are there. They can punch you. Those geysers. Ow. Then they hurt you as well. Those arms, I should mention, they, they hurt you a lot. That picture in the bottom left-hand corner, that is your health. So, keep that in mind. Once that picture disappears, you're, you're, you're gone. Oh, that arm got Some drops. Keep going. Big one. Come on, pick it up. I should mention, too, that the controls in this game are not the best. I'll be honest. They're not great. There we go. Get that little dot at the end, and that's your way out. Jump into stuff again. stuff. That present that I set out there is a special kind of scare thing. Uh, I've never gotten it to work, <laughs> to be honest. There's different things. Pretty good scares. Uh, this is a time when electronic art is used to make interesting games. I mean, I couldn't even tell you how to bring this game to, like, now. Like, if you wanted to remake Haunting in this generation. I have no idea. It probably couldn't be done at all. Like, there's no way. She's about to leave, but get a little bit more ectoplasm out of her. Now she can run out. There we go. Mimi is gone. Now I'll check the map again. Vito is right by here. There we go. This is the dad. Jump into some, some blue things. Get him started. So I'll rip your freaking arm off with this, or cut it rather. It's pretty good. The game has come to life. <laughs> I should mention this game isn't really scary, but it's just kind of ridiculous, and and it's fun because of that. Some people are afraid of mice. I guess that works. Dude, why isn't this guy f leaving? Beat it. Go. Man, where'd he go? Man, he went far. Still freaked out. Swamp thing. 
Um, yeah, I was, what I was gonna say, this game isn't really that scary, but, uh, you know, it's fun. It's, it's scary and what I assume horror fans find funny. Like, not so corny. Kind of, kind of fear. That type of thing. The spider. Right before he leaves, just get a couple more drops out of him. There we go. I'll get rid of him. Okay, so we got two of them down. Let's see. We have uh, Tony and Flo. I think I'll go after Tony next. Let's see. Should be over here. Here we go. Uh, I should probably show off um, oops, some of the special stuff I can do. Like I said, there was that present, which I don't know how to use. And then, uh, then there's this, Voodoo, which basically are bombs. And that works okay. Not incredibly well. Those are the ones that are better. Once again, it's good to use the blue ones first. That didn't take a lot to freak him out, huh? Now, where'd he go? <laughs> to this room. I guess is the living room. That's my guess. Do some blue things. Now stay in here and waiting in case he tries to do that. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not done with you yet. Get over there. Get over there. Positioning, that's it's a big part of this game. You do want to scare them a lot in one room because remember that means more ectoplasm for you. Okay, I think that's about it. So he ran back in this room. Or he may have ran into another room. He went back to his I think that's his bedroom. That's one thing that actually bothers me about this game. I don't understand why the characters run back into rooms they already know are haunted. That's, I guess, a flaw in this game. Didn't think about that. And there we go. He's gone. All that's left is flow, which is... I think that's the kitchen. Let's try going that. Oh, I should mention uh, the menu that I bring up for those uh, special scares. That's with the C button. A button jumps into things. And then B button gives you this thing. It's a, it's a kick. Or if you hold it down, charge it up. That's for something else that, I, that I'll show you later. A lot of blue things in this room. Kinda, kinda hard for that reason. There we go. We're waiting. <laughs> Bloody head looks pretty good. Bloody table. I like how afterwards they just return back to whatever they were before. Oh, here we go. Okay. See this this flying thing here with the dreadlocks almost? Yeah, those are monsters that try to steal your ectoplasm. And they'll also go after you. Now, like I said, you can't be killed while you're in here. But if you get hit, 
they steal some of your ectoplasm. So, yeah, you don't want that. So, that is a problem that you'll have to deal with. What's worse is uh, in the later levels, they have a dog that can sniff you out. And uh, if the dog sniffs you out and starts barking, then uh, one of those uh, creatures will come out. So that's annoying. Eventually, you'll start seeing them everywhere. So it's just going to be something that you'll have to deal with every single time. Efficiently freaked out. And there we go. There is the, uh, the first level. And uh, <laughs> it's a fun it's a fun game. Um, there you go, though. There's the first level. Um, I'm gonna stop the recording here in just a moment. And uh, hopefully you'll check out the next videos see the, uh, the way the game unfolds. Um, I've never beaten this game, so this is really an attempt. But uh, last time I played this game, I almost beat it. I got to the I got to the last boss, so I think I'll be able to do it this time. Uh, check in next time, and we'll do level 2 of Haunting starring Guy. Hello everyone, welcome back to Color Wind Plays Haunting and uh, I haven't posted a video about this game in a while, but uh, I am still trying to complete it. So, uh, ah, let's get started. I am not doing so well this time. No, I don't know what those letters are for. Uh, in case you missed the first video, uh, for this coloring plays, I'm doing something a little bit different. Um, instead of just giving you a piece of the game, I am actually going to try to complete this game. So that's why this is going to be broken up into different parts. Ah, jeez, man. However, that is not going well today. Um, after you complete a level, I should explain why I'm here. Um, after you complete a level, you have to come back to this area to fill up on uh, ectoplasm. So part one was the first level, and now part two is going to be this level. And there is somebody in the room with me. Got to set up some scares. Remember, blue ones charge up, so it's always good to fill those up so there's always something in reserve to scare them. Frickin' dog. scare oh, she's still getting scared I'm gonna get a lot of ectoplasm for this <laughs> you ain't going nowhere I got you Ooh, it's a floating chair it melts okay I got nothing else She's just gonna have to run. Ectoplasm. She's not in this room, man. <laughs> I scared her, scared her two rooms over. Or she went back. Huh. Okay.
the hell out of here, dog. Oh, it's Tony. No, I don't I don't want to go after you right now. Maybe you went far. There we go. It's important to stay on one person at a time because while you leave them alone, they'll grow to be less scared. Okay, I am not doing well today. I'm having an off day. That's not good. Going into places I shouldn't be. Be scared of the skunk. It smells. You don't believe me? See? Take a dump on you. What the sandworm? <laughs> I gotta get some ectoplasm out of this. I'm halfway. Come on, girl. I need you to leave. Come on. Get out. Run for your life. There we go. Not making good progress. She keeps going into the same rooms over and over. That's quite dumb of her. Get out. Nope, not dealing with you. Still have a girl to scare. Girl, you need to leave. You, you frickin' dog. Ugh. How annoying. Alright, I'm back here again. Not doing so well. I need something to get my health back in here, because... Again, you don't have any lives. You die here once, that's it. Game over. Come on, cut me a break. Ow. My eyes are blinking. I'm almost dead. This game today is not doing me any favors. That was close. Pick it up. Again, that's the one problem with this game. Controls are not precise. Okay, you never left. Come on. Get going. Leave. <sighs> Got 
gotta be able to do something. Girl does not want to leave. Not like I'm not scaring her, she's just dumb. back into the same places. You already know this room is haunted. Leave. Is there anything that can help me out here? Anything at all? Nothing? <sighs> Good, she finally left. back here. Dumb dog. Get out my face. Where is this guy? There he is. He's in the bathroom. Set some stuff up. You know, this bathroom doesn't have a shower. That's weird. Come on. <laughs> Cannonball. Ghost towel. <laughs> Get a fish in the tub. go. Okay, went to the, I don't know, living room, I guess this is. Let's see. Set some of these up. He's going to make a run for it already? ran all the way over here. Guy's a coward. Well, I can get rid of him quick. I don't care. Go ahead and be a coward. You can make my life easier. Okay. Now we have the mother who's here and Tim left. Flo and Tim. I can do it. I could hypothetically get her to run out of this room. Hmm. I'm 
Let's add ectoplasm. I need a boost. There we go. Dog, get the hell out of here. I'm gonna hit you in the face. And there's nothing else for me to jump into. One out of the house. Yes! Funk. My acto. Alright, Tim. You're you're the only one standing. I think your frickin' sister took me so long. There we go. Always get the blue ones. Those are the ones that can be set up. Just wait in here. Paint. It's scary. Last minute. <laughs> Back up. I am not done with you yet. <laughs> it seemed like do nothing to him. I'm running out of stuff. Get out of here. Where are you? Hmm. Oh, that was not a blue one. Okay. Nope, he's gonna run anyway. Got the one. Set that one up. Not a lot to set up. <laughs> Googly eyes. Wow, I have no idea what that is. <laughs> Iceman cometh. Ball of death. <laughs> Bloody table. Spaceship. Really? Two of them? Punks? My ecto. Wow. This guy freaking hightailed it. Where is this dude? Jeez Louise. <laughs> I really scared this guy. <laughs> He ran clear across the freaking house. <laughs> Surprised he didn't leave like he should. You're going in the wrong house, dude. The wrong rooms. Should do something. <laughs> Come on, beat it. So he's all the way over here. Okay, good. That means he should be leaving very soon. Let's 
setting it up. I don't need any more. I just need you to leave. Yeah. Okay, and that's another level down. Tune in for the haunting, or just haunting, starring Poltergeist Part Two. Uh, probably next week. All right. Catch you later. Bye. Hello, everyone, and welcome to Colorwind Plays Haunting Part Three. Well, this is uh, now the third entry in this series. Uh, uh, we have completed level two. We're now on to level three. And as you know, before the beginning of every level, I have to go into the uh, dungeon part of uh, the game and uh, fill up on uh, ectoplasm. Uh, in case you forgot, I need ectoplasm in order to stay inside the uh, human world. Uh, in which case, during that time, I'm invincible. However, during here, I am not. Uh, I am almost dead. So, uh, this may, ooh, be a very short video. Like, very short. <laughs> One more hit and I'm done for. Ooh. So close, oh my god, I'm gonna die. And I'm dead. Wow. <laughs> okay, well, <laughs> I knew this might be a very short video. Oh boy. Okay, well, what can I say? I knew that might happen. For continuity, I'll still put this up. So, this has been Colin <laughs> Plays Haunting Part 3. Uh, was not able to beat the game, but, uh, it's a fun game. If you, uh, come across it, I would pick it up. Um, I think you can get it for, like, ten bucks. Um, <laughs> what can I say? This has been Colorwind Plays, Haunting Star, starring Guy for the Genesis. Catch you guys later. Bye. <laughs> hey, everyone. Welcome back to Colorwind Beats, and I'm going to beat Haunting Starring Poltergeist this time. You may remember, or may not, uh, I did a series called Colorwind Plays Haunting Starring Poltergeist. That was essentially the very first Colorwind beat. It's just I didn't know what I was going to do with the series at that time. And I died trying to go into the third stage because I had to get more ectoplasm and I died in the process. So I decided that I will not let that stand and I will instead complete the game because there's no real finishing, like there's no extra stuff to do. It's just get through the game, you win. I'm going to do that. So I am now here. I've used a level, level skipping cheat in the game to get to the third level of the game, which I am to understand is halfway through the game, so I made it halfway, at least. I can say that. So let's get started with this. Okay, so we got a scary one. We got Tony here. I have some lava and some candles, fireworks, which isn't even that scary. Some bees. <laughs> Screw you, dog. Pay no attention. Oh no. Well, he's very scared. So the next time I come here. This is what killed me last time, but it's okay because I got full health. Because this is technically the first time I've been here. Oops. Okay, that is a fountain. Is there something like pulling me? Ow. Okay. Get ectoplasm. Okay, health wise, I'm good. Ow, I'm bad. No! Stop it! Jerk. Get the goop. Ow. 
Ah, damn it. No! Okay. <laughs> no, screw you. I always want to get me near those hands. Screw those hands. Okay. No! Damn you! right there. Let's get out of here. Whew. Okay, that was decent. Not great, but decent. And you. Get out of here. Beat it. Okay. Screw you, dog. Look at that. Get out of here. Okay. There is a way for him to get out of here. Beat it. Leave. I went out the wrong door. Dude, don't do this to me. Leave. See, there shouldn't be lava in this room. You need to go. Wrong. No, 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 no. Why are you going over there? No. Come on. Screw you, dog. Piss yourself. Blow your top. Be very scared. Now leave. Don't get out of here. Here you go. Alien. Alien thing. Alien thing. Be very afraid. Leave. Now we go into the blue ones. Okay. You got two out of them. Go on to the proper door. No! Damn you! God damn it, get out of here! Can't get any blue ones. Fine. Shut up, dog. Fireworks. I'm not entirely sure why that scares you, but I'll go for it. Please, go back over here. There. Bloody torso. Leave. Go the right way. Yes. Good. Okay. You gotta get him over here. I need something over here. Please, give me something, man. There, line. You gonna leave? Yes! Yes! It got rid of him. Okay, that took forever. Okay, Mimi. Mimi, you're next.
What else can I haunt in here? Space alien. Get over here. All right. Okay. Go for the panda bear. In here. And I'll hide in here just in case. That should be enough. Fear very high. Good, good, good. No, wrong way. There you go. There you go. Okay. Let's see if I can get her to leave quickly. Lion. Yeah! There we go. Mimi is gone. Okay. Vito, you are the closest, so you're next. Go over here. Go in the store. Go over here. There you are. Okay. What is this? Like a like a steam room? This is nice. <laughs> that was funny looking. Plunger that walks. Plunger that walks. Fucking plunder. Fuck you, dog. Be scared. Ooh, a naked woman. All our intestines, oh no. Godzilla. Okay, good, good, good. Freak him out and get him out of here. Bones. There you go. Have some bones. Leave. Okay. Ooh, okay. There is a room, a door here. I'll go with this. Go with this for protection. Stay in here. Okay. You can leave the house. Can leave the house? Yeah! Alright. Only one left. Only one more left. Flow. Okay. Alright, flow. Screw you, dog. Screw you. Freaking that ghost head thing. What is it called again? Okay. Kitchen. That's stereotypical. Go into the pot, okay. Go into the cabinet. Go into the other cabinet. Go into this cabinet. Go stay in here. Just in case. All their heads. <laughs> okay. Whoa, that looks weird. <laughs> Look where we're at. Suck it. I don't even know what that thing was. table. Okay, I think you've had enough. Just get out of here so we can get the ectoplasm. Hurry up and run! Okay. 
There's no way you're that calm yet. That would look good. There's a door here. No, you're going the wrong way. You're going the wrong way. Damn it. Go in here. Okay, leave. Really? Fine, have some of this. Okay, leave. Why are you becoming less scared? That doesn't make sense. There, die. Leave the room. Not that way. Damn it. You're not gonna listen. Dog, beat it. Ow. Screw you. Wait, where did where'd she go? Man, she ran all the way over here. Okay, you know what? I'm okay with that. Because there is a door in here. That you can lead through. Let's go check it out. Now hide in here in case you decide to be dumb. Lion. Boom. Leave the house. Yeah! Yeah! Lane, aren't they? Dude, those were some fresh pranks we pulled on them. In there, huh? It goes too slow to text. Sweet! This game is fun. <laughs> Did I tell you why I hate these sardines? Well, it was one bright sunny day. Didn't they kill him or something? I was skating down the street, and hey, wait! You better keep after those scumbags. Oh, I'm not gonna tell him. I'm pretty sure that's what it was. I think they did something to kill him. Okay, this is it. I'm tired of toying with these ugly suckers. Hmm. No more Mr. Nice Ghost. Let's grab some green goo and really nail him. In the next video. Okay, stay alive, stay alive, stay alive. If not, it's okay, because I know the level skip trick now, and I'll just do that if I die, but I don't really want to- Ow. Where did the other drop go? Just grab it. Okay. I do wish the controls were a little tighter in this game, but this is a fun, fun game regardless. Like, that's a problem, but it doesn't really get in the way of, of the, the enjoyment. No. I'm back up there? Damn it. Wait, am I going reverse now? I am. Think they ran out of layout designs and they just like screw it, just go go just go backwards. Eh. Oh, okay, I'm done. Cool. Alright. Okay. Let's scare some fools. Alrighty. <laughs> Set up some pranks for you. I 
don't think she liked that one. Okay, and then I'll hide in here. So much ecto coming out. What the hell? It's just some old man. <laughs> that ought to be good. Really? That wasn't enough? Screw you then. Let's screw you some more. Sandworm. The Sarlacc pit. You got a Sarlacc pit in your house, girl. Is that enough? No? Come on, get out of here. Okay, that has to be enough. Leave. Really? Okay. Fine. Oops. Wrong button. Go. Get it. What's happening with this thing? I will take all of this. Chain here? Yes. Is there a door in this place? I don't know. Really? None of this? Shut up, dog. dog. Where did she go? Oh, I went through the wrong door. She went up here. Okay, you know what? That's fine, because I don't even see an exit over there, so... Where is an exit around here? There's one in the room to the right. That sucks. Freaking dog. A dog does so much damage now. Okay. Where did she go? 
Alrighty. Jump in there. Ooh, there is a way out here. Okay. Are you gonna leave? Yeah! Get the hell out. Mimi is gone. Okay, Flo is in the room to the right, so you're next. <laughs> That's right, there's something under the floors. Go check out this cactus. Okay. <laughs> or not. Fucking dog. Go in here. Okay, there's plenty of things for her to check on here. She's just... What? Damn it! I want to go back into the the underground, at least not yet. Come on, start shaking. I need some macroplasm. I'm gonna. If she starts running out, I'm going to use this to get some more. Why is there two now? Go in the other room. More goop, more goop. More goop. Okay, doing fine. I'm still not dead or anything. That's good. As a matter of fact, I think I have more health now. So that's fine. This is the final house. Eh. Ow, ow, stop, stop it. Why? Why must you do this to me? Just stay in one direction. Okay. The way that these freaking underground stages are done there are weird. Oh, she's gonna leave! She's gonna leave! Yeah! Flow is gone. Okay. Only the men are left. Okay. Veto. Checking out the bathroom, huh? Fuck you, dog! I've had about enough of that dog. Mm, that's kind of messed up. <laughs> that's a weird alien looking thing. Eating the poop from the toilet. <laughs> <laughs> mm, 
Doing half or that. That's not at all the one I wanted, but okay. Dude from the ground. Tar monster. Tar hand. Or a claw, even. Wrong one, fool. Go to the other door. Shut up, dog. Scared him all the way over here. But where'd he go? Damn, that dude booked it! Shut up, you stupid dog. Okay, there is a door here. I'm gonna bring him right next to it. Just in case. Fuck you, dog. Okay, still alive. Only one left. Probably gonna have to go to the underground one more time. That just sucks. Still alive, still alive, okay. Can't be mad at that. Although, you know, it's a cool it's cool right now because right now I'm not desperate to not go to the underground. Okay, where'd he go? Okay, he went to the left. There is a door in here. Okay, are you gonna leave? Yes, leave! Yeah! Now where do I go? Oh. Oh my. You! Stupid dog! Wait, what is happening? Oh my god. <laughs> I'm back in the underground. Okay. Ah! Ow, ow, ow. Okay. 
Ow! Stop it! Oh my god, this is so hard. I just want my goop! Goop, come to me, goop. Oh, why? Why do you want me to go back there? Okay. Okay. Screw you. Screw you bats, screw you arms. Yeah! Oh god. Okay. Hang on. Okay, final boss. What do I do about you? Can't kick you. Screw you. Can't get near the thing now. What is happening? The game is glitching out! The game is glitching out! But I'm winning! Should I roll with it? Okay, it stopped. Oh god. Oh god. Oh god. It's not the direction I wanted at all. What do I do here? What do I do there? What am I supposed to do there? Damn it, I'm back here? supposed to do about those spiders? Those spider brain things. Ow. Stupid bats. Ow. Damn you arms. No, you did not get me. Going back this way, damn it. Okay, okay, okay. Big goop. Can we wrap it up here? Grab it! Screw you! Alright, out of here. Okay, what am I supposed to do with these brains? Okay, that worked. Come on, that hit him. No! 
How did I miss that? Why is there more now? Ow, no! Something exploded. Oh, God. Back here again. Why? Why is this my life right now? Throwing those stupid things are impossible. It's practically luck. Oh no, why? Why? Got it. Goop, 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 goop. Eh? No, that's not an exit. No! Just jump over there. Okay. Big goop. Back over here for a small goop. Screw you, arms. Goop. Goop all day. Ow! No! No! Damn you! Just okay. I wrong way. Okay, two goops. And now these guys are faster. Of course they are. Ah, oh, goop. No, goop, goop, goop. No, goop. Where's the goop? Give me the goop. Give me the goop. Damn, you gotta have like perfect game. No, come on. See that? I we landed like right next to him. Screw you guys. No, stop hitting the wall! Damn it! Oh my god, that was full health. Thank you. Fuck you. <laughs> No, what? Just, no, just grab it. Okay, come on, just... I want this to be over with. Stupid freaking brain spider things. You just can't hit them! Screw your hands. No! Just grab it. No, what the? Just, just walk over there, dude. And that's gonna go back, huh? Of course it is. I think I'm repeating just the same, like, layout now. I think it's just switching between two of them. No, bats. Ow. No, damn you. Why is there so many again? Do they respawn each time? Screw you.
screw you guys, screw you guys, screw you guys, screw you guys. No, stop hitting the freaking wall! Goop. Only one. Only one. Screw you. Ah! Uh. Ah! Damn it! I hate you guys so much! Just die! Ow, no! Damn it, this sucks. No. Ow. No, damn you, damn you. I knew it. I knew it was gonna switch at some point. No, don't get caught on the frickin' wall. Okay. Get out! No, damn you! Just get the exit! No, how did you miss the goop? No! Oh god. I got him! I got him! I got him! Yes! Woo! I'm alive! I'm dead. So I didn't need contracts. What the hell? What a hosing that was. I thought I showed him what, who was really boss. Then I got slammed. Oh well, at least I taught those sorry sardinis a thing or two. You can bet I'll be back for more serious spooking soon. Later, dude. I won. I freaking won. <laughs> oh my god, that final boss fight is bullshit. Ah, those spiders, I hate those spiders. And the game glitched out or something at some point, I don't know what that was. All the, the, the music went all screwy and... I don't know, I guess he was supposed to come after me or something, but I don't know, I just went with it. Game glitched out. And besides, those spiders were... Way harder anyway. Oh my god. Well, I finished the game. 
To my knowledge, there is no extra content for you to do, so that means I also completed it. You just need to get through the game, that's it. I feel good. I don't know if I've ever beaten the game... No, wait, I have. I have beaten the game once. Only once, though. I've played this game very a lot of times, but I only did it once. Yo, bud, Poltergeist here again. Hey, you know about the Sardini family, right? Yeah, what about him? Filthy rich backstabbing slime is what they are, and they dissed me good. Wait, this is just the intro, isn't it? It's just playing the intro again? So I'm back for a little counter dissing. Yeah, with me? Cool, let's get busy. Yeah, that's just the intro. Yeah, that's just the intro. Okay, never mind. Alright, well then, that's the end of the video then. Alright, this has been Colorwind Beats Haunting starring Poltergeist for the Sega Genesis. I highly recommend you check this game out. You can get it on the Sega Genesis. And oddly enough, there is a PSP collection, I believe, called EA Replay. And it's a collection of old Electronic Arts games, and this is one of them. So, you can also get it there, oddly enough. So, the Genesis and the PSP. Go figure. Alright, this has been Color Beats, Haunting Starting Poltergeist for Sega Genesis, and I will catch you next time. Bye.